Hey there, Pisces. Welcome to your reading for the week of December 7th. This week, you have an amazing week again. Uh, you know, things are, I think, kind of looking up for Pisces now and, and starting to move forward. But the Ten of Clubs, great card. Card of abundance, things being abundant in your life, abundance returning to your life. Uh, and this is abundance in a lot of ways. It's not just you know, money. It doesn't just have to do with money. It has to do with like abundance in a lot of areas. People coming into your life, helping, offering you help, assistance out of nowhere. Um, you know, you know, your friends offering you assistance, making new friends under this card, meeting a new group of people, going out and meeting new groups of people, uh, learning. It's just a huge card, anything you can think of, uh, but it expands the mind. Definitely a thinking week. I, I mean, definitely a week of, of thinking of learning i think pisces has been a lot of pisces not all but a good percentage have been learning something new learning a bunch of new things even different things and that can help them out this is all comes up with this card abundance in your whole life really great card next you have the king of spades i think pisces is turning into the king of spades in a lot of ways because to me pisces has been like the most challenged out of any sign and the king of spades has been through a lot of battles and really challenged but now he's the king and He's learned from all those battles. He's learned from all those hard times, and he's become something, you know, more. He's become more than a man, you know, really. It's it's a pretty deep card. And I say man, but I don't attach sex to my card. So it doesn't matter if you're male or female. This is happening to all Pisces. It's like you're becoming something else, something more than just human. Uh, the, the King of Spades people, they don't. Uh, they don't act like normal people in a good way. Um, you know, they don't they don't overreact to anything. They don't get angry anymore at people or anything like that. And it's because they've just seen so much stuff and so much crap, to be quite honest, that nothing really affects them anymore. So, you know, embrace those qualities. It's also a card of being a leader. So definitely step up and be the leader this week. Next, you have the four of clubs. Four of clubs, really what I'm getting off of this is the main meaning, which is uh, double check things, double check everything this week. It's a card of, you know, if you're signing any contracts, double check them. It's also a card of creating win-win solutions and situations. So if, I mean, you know, I always give the example with this card, if you're signing a contract, but the other side could lose on the contract, you need to fix that uh, because, you know, that will come back to bite you. It's a card of needing, having it be super important that things are really fair under this card, um, which isn't always the case. It doesn't always need to be that way, but when this card comes up, it's like you really need to create some win-win solutions. It's also a card that says if you're stuck in any legal type situations or anything like that, that if you could just come up with a win-win situation, if, whether it's a divorce or, or whatever it may be, Sorry about that pause. I had to pause for a second there. Um, but again, with this four of clubs, it's a win-win. Really important to create those win-wins. That's what's important to this card. Next is the Queen of Hearts, which is Pisces all the way right here. Uh, this card represents Pisces. Definitely going to be in your element this week, so that's a good sign. It puts you in a position of strength, which really kind of uh, makes things uh, more go your way this week. You kind of have a little bit more pull. You probably have a little bit more pull with people even this week. Be a little. You, you'll probably be a little bit more. You know, I guess what I'm trying to say is you'll have like a way with words uh, with people this week, and you'll kind of be able to really gel with people and get them on your side and all of those things with this card. Next. You have the Ace of Clubs card of great abundance. Again, very similar to that Ten of Clubs at the beginning, so you're kind of getting a double message here. But the Eight of Clubs can bring in uh, you know, money uh, money gains to you, big money gains even, surprising money gains that you don't expect. Uh, and it can also bring in love, uh, unexpected love as well. So just know that those things are on the table. And finally, you have the Ten of Diamonds, improvements in money after a very difficult period of time things improving financially in 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 all other areas of your life so this is a great card I'd like to see this brings in a lot of stability and it's a card that takes time it builds but it's a card that kind of like in the future allows you to be more stable financially and things like that so all in all looks like a great week enjoy it